morning, everybody. Hope you're well. So I've had a few people down. There's been a fire. Chairs have been used, not put back. The spares have been used. They've been at log cabin. I had a fire in there. The floor's all out of way. Bottles thrown around. Other than that, it's not really that bad. It's a bit of crap. It's need to pick up. I don't know where the room. Um, the rubbish bin's gone. We'll have a look around, eh? Over in the second small shelter. Yeah, it's got to tidy that up, put chairs away, put a shovel away. Big shelter's alright, just a couple of leaves, a few leaves blown in. Everything's alright in there. Uh, right back here. That's probably been pushed off there because with that on there you can't see the blue tart from the uh, riverside. No, but I can't see any more damage other than what there is. I'll cover that back up. The small amount of wood that I had in the log store has been used. A bit of that's been used too. Not too bad in all really, it's been worse. Still Neanderthal behaviour. Uh, so yeah, before we crack on with that, I'm going to make a brew. Uh, Steph's coming down in a bit, so we're going to have a bit of a picnic together. So yeah, I'll get a brew up going and then we'll get cracked on. Right, I've just sorted out this back corner, put that back on there again. I still need to play with the roof and get that uh, tied down properly. Those stones need to be taken off and uh, actually tied on properly. I've covered this back up, just got one of the buckets out to give us an hand. Putting all the uh, waste in. This branch, this branch here, it had been bent all the way back here. I don't know who's taking that branch off there. But anyway, yeah, it being bent all the way over there. So I've released it. So hopefully it's going to spring back up and grow its natural path, which is up there, which is what we want. I'll show you what else. I've tied it up in here. Empty the fireplace, I think there were about three or four bottles that had been smashed and there were one that was melted down in the fire, so I've taken all the glass out and put them in the bag. Put the floor back on. Just straightened up in here. Uh, these three chairs were in a bag each. One bag is missing so I can only presume that it's been burnt, because it's not here. But that bed's in one piece, I put roll mat back there. So I'm thinking I might just do a little bit of weeding, get rid of a, a few weeds, these up here, a few of these, because I dare say there's going to be a tent put up here on Saturday night. I'll leave it around the trees because it looks quite cool, all that growing around there, and a bit of that. Two lads just walking away there, just walked up to me and started uh, saying, oh, you've done a great job lad. Uh, been down a few times. Yeah, so they've been down a few times and they were just going to go further up the island up there to start building their own shelter. And I went, <laughs> went no, I'm sorry mate, he says, you can't do that. He says, I've got permission to be here, it's, you know, it's privately owned woodland. Uh, you can't really start doing that because like I said, I've got permission. So I can't really allow us to do it. And I went, oh, sorry, um, we thought we were just open woodland. And I explained the whole situation to him. And they were both sound, they went, all right, fair dues. And I said, look, you seem like sound lads. Come and use my shelters, all I asked for is you just take all your crap away and tidy up and they said thank you very much cheers mate and uh, we shook hands and that were it right then I've got something to show you so I've waited back around here left some light around trees that I haven't touched that uh, crocus like that carry on staying there just cleared this a bit I only got to here then I saw the lads coming I'm gonna leave all this at back here just to let it grow a bit and camouflage the back a bit more. I've weeded a bit round here. And so, next up, I'm going to make a new fire pit. This one's been in place, I don't know, maybe touching two years now. So I'm thinking, I'm going to make it a bit squarer, a bit more central. So, progress so far. I dug the pit. Start putting the stones in. It's going to be a bit of a longer pit, this. Put some more stones over there as well, which I'm going to use. Steph's arrived. We've had his picnic. I, uh... <laughs> so 
Yeah, keep tracking on. There you go. I'd call that a massive upgrade. That's, that's it. We're heading in. Just a quick one this week. I was getting out a checkup on camp. Not a dig because people had been down. Moved stuff, burnt stuff. And all that led to me building a new fire pit. That should be good for Saturday. So, thank you very much for watching, everybody. Thanks for the support. I'll see you again very soon. Bye bye.